about sex because it's the only thing that I'm good at. But tonight is what? Tonight is a little bit different. Um, um, you take your clothes off finally. Yes. <laughs> yes, I'm getting started right now. So one of the things that um, I like doing is wait. No. Okay. So we're going to talk about some stuff that I found really interesting. And as a staunch atheist, one of the coolest things about being Team No Jesus is that I can pick my God whenever I want. Like, it changes on a weekly basis. Um, about two months ago, it was those Coca-Cola freestyle machines, because like, there's nothing about those that isn't correct. Yeah, but uh, they are amazing. And then, They're pain in the ass. <laughs> Actually, I But they taste So, um, and then a little while after that, it was this really cool training that I met down in Starship because, like, she's awesome and taught me how to make my own flavored lube, which, again, is miraculous. And then these days, for those of you that like the internet, um, my god is currently Brittany Matthews from the most popular girls in school. Anybody? Yeah! Cool. cool. She. Let's always fuck her butthole. Not the growler. Her butthole. I don't know what that fucking growler is. But what I want to throw out there is that there are a multitude of different religions. Um, and if you want to check mine out personally, I actually, there's a website. It's called www.gaytube.com. So feel, feel free to check that out. And he's wrong. You have every right to be as happy or as sad as you want. So, um,. Yeah, you're welcome. And nobody's, nobody's ever going to show up to say that once. I'm sorry. Thank you. So, okay, so from here on out, um, if you hadn't picked up on this, um, I'm I'm a homosexual. Yeah. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. What? yeah. Craziness. Rocking out with penises. <laughs> so, the thing that's really cool to me is that because of that one dude that said there is nothing more powerful than an idea whose time has come, starts with V, anybody? I don't remember who said it. But the thing about it is that as we continue to transcend gender identity, most people don't immediately look at me and go, Betty! <laughs> because I will kill them a lot. And because I'm not, I'm not that obvious unless I'm six shots in and talking with my hands on stage. So, um, one of the things that really frustrates me about this is that straight men are totally fine with it. And like, most of the time I sit down and I have conversations with straight men about like my sexuality specifically, because it's they're fascinated by it. Mostly because I get anal all the time and they have to fight for it. <laughs> so, for, for them, I'm kind of like, Shit like that. 